Hi guys, Logan here with another video. Today, I have something cool to show you. This is the brand new for 2022 Mr. Resentful Pumpkin made by Seasonal Visions and sold exclusively at the Home Depot. This is one of their many in-store only light up pumpkin props for this year and it's one of their brand new ones that Seasonal Visions did. I believe Seasonal Visions has done a total of three for this year. And this one, I feel like, is probably the most obscure one. Um, I haven't really heard a lot of people talk about him. Uh, I haven't seen, I haven't really even seen a lot of coverage of this guy yet. So, I just don't know if maybe he's not as common to find in stores. Or what. But, it's a pretty cool item. Essentially, this is just a menacing grimacing. Uh, in terms of what it does, the lighting effect, even the build. It has that little back hatch that Grimacing has. Though, he has a totally unique face. It's a lot more uh, spooky and stylized. And he looks a lot more uh, rotten than Grimacing. And he's way smaller. I believe this one is 12 inches. So about the size of an average pumpkin, if not the size of an average pumpkin. He has an asymmetrical face, which is just something I always like. I like asymmetry. Uh, the face looks pretty crudely carved, which I think is super duper dope. Um, it's just, he looks very scary, a lot scarier than I think Grimacing looks in terms of the face. Uh, he does have a constant, you know, LED light. I think this is the exact same lighting effect as Grimacing. Uh, he, it looks like he's painted a little better than him. Which, I think because he's smaller, it makes it easier to do that. But it's got he's got the same little, like, mesh... A little, like... Screen. That Grimacing has, and a lot of other SVI pumpkins have... That gives it a kind of sparkling, flaming effect. And it looks really good. Even the camera picks it up pretty well too. But it looks even better in person. So he has no audio. It is just this silent LED flame function. And it's really simple and I really like it. A lot of props do have a USB-C function. This one does not have that. I know the other SVI Flaming Pumpkin does. Which I do have coming in, so I will showcase that, because I don't really know the actual name of it yet. So, I will, um, you know, showcase that. So, this guy is not available online, which is a bummer. He is in-stores only. I believe all the pumpkins are in-store only, except for Grimacing and the pumpkin stock, for obvious reasons. So, I did have to order this via Mercari, because my store didn't have anything they just they didn't get anything in this year they never do uh which is super disappointing this guy is going for 25 bucks a piece which i think is a really good deal given that it's a pretty solid blown mold pumpkin it's a really good design and i mean he looks really creepy and the led lights inside of him look pretty good it's not like the Jimmy or Techie flame lights where it has the rotate, where they had the rotating reflective uh, piece in them. It's just LEDs that flicker in a way that look like uh, like flames, like a, like a candle lights in him. But I still think it looks good, and I still really like it. I've got a whole bunch of pumpkins on the way, by the way, guys, and I'm really excited. And this was just. The first one that's really showcaseable because it does something. I got one of the Scarecrow ones in, but it doesn't really do anything. So, yeah. I'm obviously obsessed with these pumpkins. I really like them. And the new ones this year seem to be a lot brighter. They look cooler. So, this year we've got Pan-Asian making pumpkins, Seasonal Visions making pumpkins, and as always, Techie making pumpkins. 
and all of which I am equally as pleased with. I think all companies have done a excellent job this year. This is my favorite of the uh, all the new pumpkins. I I really think he looks the best. I definitely recommend this one the most. Again, I don't know if like he's only going into the select stores or what. I've not really seen much of Resentful. I've even texted someone who was like a huge buff on the uh, the Home Depot pumpkins. He had no idea this one even existed. So, and I've not seen a lot of coverage. I've not even heard a lot of people talk about Mr. Resentful. So, I don't really know how common he is. I mean, the the really unique and cool pumpkins themselves really aren't easy to find, especially this late in the season. So, I guess if you want, like, a really unique and cool pumpkin, you're going to have to go through a scalper like I did. Um, I had to go through a scalper for all my pumpkins this year. Which is a bummer, but you gotta do what you gotta do. Am I right, guys? But, yeah, this is Mr. Resentful. This, again, my favorite of the year. He looks really cool. The sculpting is really nice. He's got the same kind of bumpy, like, rotten texture as Grimacing. And kind of the same paint job. And then they darken it around the face. And the face is just so cool. And I like how wrinkled and warped it is. Like, he's got a almost like a human snarl. I just think it's such a really well done pumpkin for this year. Uh, it's one I recommend for sure. If you do what I do, I do a big pumpkin patch every year. I get a whole bunch of pumpkins and I grow it every, year by year. And this year is be the biggest it'll ever be. You know, I definitely think this is a a standout piece. I think it is really cool. I think it looks really unique. Uh... I really don't have any complaints besides the fact that this is coming off. But I don't know if it's just mine or all of them. So I really, I won't say that it's a quality issue because it, it could literally just be mine. You know, I've again, I've not really heard much about these guys from anyone else. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.